this late night show, we're giving you a piece of heaven because with me today is Radical 7 7. Oh, bars, man! <laughs> bars! Thank you. Hey! Thank you, you too. I know. You're blessed. <laughs> oh, yeah, you drop a freestyle yourself. Okay, where can I go? Okay, um. You call me radical and Kubo no typical. About 7 7, heaven never testifies. Come on, check him out, baby. Take it out. Forget the last one. It's gonna pass. I'm a for a ballet. Could you keep me a wallet? Keep my money a wallet. You still wanna roll with me? I'm a bum in your phone. I need to whip my finger. Come on, let's get in. She wants to take it. Get in for JJ1. For London, man, they call me up and down. But making all the door. Magic, I love the way it makes my beat. Yeah, just. <laughs> <laughs> Radical 7 7 in the building. Yeah. Okay, quickly. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Why 7 7? Why not 77? <laughs> Is that how many? Seven, 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 seven. <laughs> I love that song. Actually, it's not, it's not bad. I, I think the seven seven, you know, seven as a number mm. has got, for me, it's got, I mean, it's because of the spiritual side of it. And um, something happened to me on um, July 7th, July 7th, which um, changed everything about me as a person, as me. Radical seven seven as a person, like you know, that was like you know years ago when I was run over by a truck. <gasps> and, um, what? Yeah, I was run over by a truck and where? Um, yeah, happened in Nigeria, you know. Oh, of course, yeah, expressway. Ah, oh, express. I don't. I'm going like in you know, a somewhere. It was. I was quite young and you know. You in the car, Shay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was. I was. We just came out of the car. Was we gonna cross and the, the truck was coming from the wrong <gasps> direction, and it ran over me. It broke all my jaw. What? I was actually like pronounced lifeless. No. And I, I woke up later. Hey. I woke up, and that's the reason, like you know what I'm saying. That's the reason I embraced seven seven. A lot of people don't really know. Some people, you know, Nigeria now. We 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 always have our preconceptions about things, and you know, people thought it was about fraternity. And I thought, come on. And they even say, why do they always? Why do you always dress in black, black? And I thought, they said that's why seven seven. They said, listen. You should ask me a question. Oh, thank you for asking me. See me. A lot of people asking me that question. It's about that. July 7th, the day I was Running. killed. And then I thank God I'm still alive today. Hey, someone should write a movie about your life. Definitely. There's yeah, a Nollywood movie, please. Uh... There, there, there's a song coming out called About 7-7. Seven, seven. You know, because man, a lot of questions have been asked. And you know, people have been, a lot of people are sitting down there who have been judging. A radical 7-7, seven, seven, this guy, this and that for. Yeah. Don't judge, never judge a book by its cover. You know, I'm radical, radical. This, there's a lot to me. Yeah. But I always say to people, let my names and what I say define me. Exactly. And you don't need but to go far to find me. I'm always here. Sorted. But have you always been radical, even when you were younger? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, that radical was, I was nicknamed radical by my own mom. Yeah. Out of 14, I was the only Like when you were 14? One. And out of 14 oh, children. Out of 14. How, old, of, how old were you when she nicknamed you radical? I was, I was, I was, let me see. I can say I was four years old. I remember being called radical from when so I was four years like old. And I used to cry, I used to fight because of that. I don't call me that. <laughs> <laughs> then with time, I understood myself. I realized, you know, when, when you discover yourself, I realized, hold on, I'm different. Because the, the way I say things, the way I question things, yeah. and you know, it helped me to discover more about life. I question everything. I wish I, wish I could see you when you were younger. Oh, but then I, we have to do some, uh, like some psychodynamic. Sort of some psychodynamic, we can do that. Yeah. Uh, actually, like, look at look at what I'm sitting there on. If you know how to do it, then I'll just see that you can take me back. Uh, <laughs> Let's go back in time. Let's see a throwback. <laughs> I want to see this throwback. Do you yeah. want to see a throwback? Yeah, Let's go. It. Let's go. Let's travel back in time. I don't mind. I love doing that. <laughs> like, maybe that in that direction. And, and I've got a good companion. Believe me, I'm going to, yeah, I can do that. And I'll surely come back to today. I think back in time is that direction. Over there. Bye. I can't believe that. <laughs> Look at them. They got <laughs> He's looking at me with. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> How did he get it? <laughs> oh, but I respect you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh boy, uh, that was, that's radical. amazing. That's amazing. You got me. That's me. That's, I didn't that know what is. I was holding on to. What? I was holding on to a bell. I love bell because I love doing that a lot. You say so you're musical from four. Well, yeah, look at that's a bell. Yeah, that's a bell I was holding. Yeah, yeah. It's a bell. I love you know stuff like you know string and you know something that makes that sound. Bell. Yeah, I love that too much. Yeah, I was holding onto a bell. All right. 
So back to this issue about you yeah. wanting a woman in your life eventually. Yeah, definitely. Okay, I have, I have a question for you. Yeah, go on. The woman you want, she has to be able to cook, yes or no? Um, that's going to be a bonus because now I can cook. Mm. I don't believe like in a woman has to be the one who's going to... No, just say yes or no. Just say yes or no. <sighs> Let me think just about it. Just say yes or no. Okay, yeah. If I want, yeah, okay. She has, she, 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 she. So that's a yes. If she can cook, fine. That's a yes. <laughs> if she can cook, that's fine. a yes. If she can cook, I will teach her. <laughs> so she should be able to cook. Yeah. Whether you teach her or she knows how to do it herself, she should be able to cook. Okay, cool, yeah. Yeah? All right. And she has to um, always look good. Yeah. Yeah. An yeah. African lady, they always look good. All right, good one. And should she be able to give sensual massages? Oh, boy. You like your massages, right? Yeah, you're going to. Yeah, I love You that. like your massages, <laughs> right? I do. Come on. I but need that a lot. I need that a lot. Yeah, so you <laughs> do like your massages. So even if you were with, you know, Miss Madam Wife, the mother of your, how many children? Seven kids? No, 14 no, kids? I, I want to have more than seven. Hey. I don't want my children to be radical seven. I want them to be maybe radical 14. Radical 14. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but when, when you find this woman who's ready, to born Hopefully. that many picking. Hopefully. <laughs> Will you still be accepting massages from other women? If they're ready to um, offer, like, hey, Radical 77, we love your music, and we heard you like massages, and we heard you uh, so stressed. <laughs> so please, Radical, let us give you a nice massage. Um, okay, in that case, I'm not sure if it's going to be only massage. If my, if my girl is not available, maybe I will take it if it's uh, going to go beyond massage. But... At the end of the day, like, you know, because I'm going to respect my girl so much. I will need to, like, you know, get a permission from my girl. Probably, you know what? I think I'm going to be different. My girl is going to be following me wherever I go to. So she give me massages? Yeah. So I'm going to go on stage, fine, wherever I go to. My girl, I think so. So you wouldn't... She's going to be my But, but be would, my you, would you collect massages from random girls anyway? To be sincere with you, thinking of me, considering the things that happen to artists, to entertainers these days, I don't think I'm going to do that because I don't want to be alleged with... I don't believe you. Uh, uh, DJ Pope, do you believe him? No, nah, I don't believe him. Don't believe him at all. I bet you, <laughs> Radical 77, that you accept massages from random girls. Brother. Random girls. Uh, massage, you know, because of the way that massage sounds, it sounds um, extreme. You know, massage, you've got like, you know, it's got... Maybe that massage I'm gonna get from a random girl, there's gonna be boundary. If you no, know. because I, I, I'm pretty sure you enjoy your massages. Like when a girl you is like behind you and she puts yeah, her man. arms on I you think and this you're guy like, takes it a lot. Yeah, you know, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, okay. To be sincere with you. I mean, like sometimes your expression can be what is your expression when you're getting essential massage? Are you just like, ooh. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. How did you know that? No, I'm sorry, yeah, you're an adult, I shouldn't ask you. You give me some nice, yeah. I'm not giving you one. It seems like you already have enough women. Like, <laughs> no, like, I didn't like her. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, <that. laughs> where are you going? Where did you guys think this <laughs> I don't know, but she seems to be enjoying whatever she's, she's doing. She's massaging here. my head. I, didn't know. I love that head massage. Her hand is going down. Her hand is, not ma her hand is not massaging your oh, head. Oh, she's her going somewhere going else. Down. That's she's what I'm saying. About. Okay, yeah. And you're not exactly stopping her. You're enjoying it. Yeah, but she's not random. <laughs> is, that, is that what wife you to be? No, she's The mother not. of 14 kids. She's, a, she's my model. <laughs> uh, she's she a friend still, and she's a model. She can still be potential wifey. I don't know. <laughs> What's her name? Her name is uh, <laughs> she's a model. You know, she's a model. She's a friend anyway. Okay. And All actually, right. she's from A too. She's from she's an Igbo girl. Yeah. Okay. And uh, her name is Dame J. She's people can find her. She's a very good girl, right. but she's not my girl. Okay. We're just friends. We're just friends. Yeah. All right. So what do you do in your spare time to relieve yourself of stress? If you wanna play, if you wanna chill, what do you normally do? Well, I wanna do during my spare time. Mm. Okay. I love boxing. Okay. And, and I box a lot. Yeah. And I box a lot. Whenever I box, I become more focused. Actually, like most of the songs that I write, I write them when I'm boxing. Yeah. Or when I'm driving. Yeah, I but, love driving a lot. But would you, you know how like a lot of celebrities sometimes create video games about themselves? Video yeah. games? Yeah, like you know we have the Kim Kardashian one. I've never played it. Yeah, but, I, I heard um, about that too. Yeah, where it's all about her and her 
Kim World and stuff. Would you do that yourself? Do you love video games so much that you would create a video game? Okay. Like maybe Mortal Kombat. Okay. Radical I'll, Mortal Kombat. Some stuff. Okay, I wouldn't mind something like that because mm. you know, I love creativity a lot. But believe me, Radical Seven Seven doesn't even play no games like that. No. Because I haven't got time to like you know sit <laughs> sit down those. But yeah, when I was younger, I remember Mortal Kombat. Yeah. All those games. But oh, look at look look. Do you remember? Do you remember Mortal Kombat? Too? I remember that one. Yeah, yeah. definitely. I played that. Yeah, I, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love that, yeah. <laughs> but but believe me, the last time I played a game was like you know, years back. Same really? as believing. Years back. Really? I'm pretty sure you should make like a, a, a game thing of you. But It'd if I'm so gonna cool. make a game then it's gonna be about boxing. Really? <laughs> boxing oh, and you know, music. This scene as well. Yeah, it is a, yeah. <laughs> I think this is one of the newer ones as well. I've never yeah, I've, but you know something I think they're recreating them. Yeah, because they're they look more like you know what we played in the past. I know. I mean, there's one I saw that was very, very realistic, actually. Like this oh one. Oh, boy. That's what I'm saying. How did you get that? <laughs> I was actually, what was I doing there? I was looking I was looking at something. And I was actually taken at Greenwich. It was in the Thames. Then it was like, you know, that lower tide. Yeah, I would like, yeah, I'd like to make something like that. But <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that. Oh, boy, I'm going to get that. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> You That's look, awesome. You, you don't look bad as a as a you know action figure. Yeah, a game like, figure. yeah, exactly. I think I'm gonna be doing some things like that. Yeah, I've been in some movies in United Kingdom anyway. Yeah, like Hobbit Redeem, um, The Wish of the Dying Man. You know, like you know, I love I love entertainment a lot. Okay, it's not only music. All right, so since you love entertainment a lot, not just music, are you are you a good dancer? I do my own funny dance, like what I was. Please stand up. <laughs> Let's see. Let us see. Stand up. Stand up. DJ Pope, drop a beat. Hey! Hey! Oh! Okay, now, I need not, in not, in not, not. Take the car to the stage, they didn't see the nigga thought, nigga thought, the thought, thought, don't for days. Booty go up, down. Wait, 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 stop on that note, stop on that note. Take a seat, take a seat, take a seat, take a seat. <laughs> <laughs> Put me on this floor. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know that song. There are a lot of songs about like booty go up, booty go down. You know. But there's no booty. You <laughs> <laughs> can go up and down. <laughs> what do you feel about girls doing the slut drop in clubs? Okay. Um, it's unfortunate. I'm not too much. When it comes to our ladies, I can't mm. really judge them because I can't really judge it. But me, I'm not gonna have a girl in my video doing that. I love to get to do that in the bed. Oh, in the bed. Jeez. Whew. That you're going on. But, uh, but do you think the slut drop is something appropriate that a girl should be doing outside? To be sincere with you, like I say, I can't judge them yeah. because no, they have been um, motivated with money. And you know, money causes mm. a lot of trouble. And um, you know, media has been used to like, you know, destroy a lot of women. And you know, it breaks yeah. my heart. That's one of the reasons. Okay, for instance, you know, you know, I can uh, you know, I can want to shoot a video and artist. You have these directors, these producers saying this is what you should do. In my situation, I thank God for the blessings. And I own my own record label. And you know, I, uh, producer, when they try to tell me this, these are the girls that we're gonna say, be quiet, please. Right. This is my money, and the, the, please, yeah. I'm gonna do it my way. Oh, I'm gonna course, choose definitely. the people, and you know. So when they say girls should just say, please, let's not go to that mm -hmm. extent. I don't because now I've got. I respect our ladies a lot. Of course. You know, I don't want a girl to be doing that and, you know. Yeah. Nah. I, but but so would I, you, so, so w could you ever be paid enough to do a slut drop? <laughs> paid to do that myself? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, 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 like that, that's an example. Perfect but, example of a slut but, drop. But, you know. Dip it down low and you bring it up. That, could you ever be paid to do the slut drop? Me? Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, believe me, if anyone, wa if anyone says that to me that I want to pay you to do that in my video oh believe me uh, I'm gonna cry I'm gonna cry I'm gonna lose it for the guy or for the, whoever I'm gonna lose it but you know what if a girl asks me to do that maybe I'll just do it you know, to like you know to make a statement because if we can ask girls to do that I, I'm, I've never done that if we can ask girls to do that then girls should be able to ask men to do it so if, if a girl asks me I'll do it just yeah. because I want to make a statement. So you've gone from like not liking girls doing it to saying, yeah, I would, I would do it. it just to like and make a statement because if a man can pay them to do that, then have that you, so man can. Yeah. So have you ever done it b before yourself? No, I've never done never. it. Never. No, no. Never, ever, ever. <laughs> Are you sure? Never, ever, yeah, ever, you know, ever. You know, you've been getting some pictures. Uh, 
get this on. Uh, <laughs> never, ever, ever, ever. No, I've never done that. Never, ever, 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 ever. No, I've never done that. Never, ever, 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 ever. No, I've never done that. I'm going to ask you one more time. Never, ever, 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 ever. No, I've never, ever. Let's see. <laughs> that was me getting ready to go into the things. I remember that day, like, you know, we're, we're doing some, they, yeah, I remember a photographer because I do modeling. And a photographer was going to work with me. And I said, listen, let me get her because we're going into the things. You can see, Cody Sack, you remember going in our living room? So he was going to work with me. He said, he said to me, like, you're going to look good in there. All this mud, you know. And I said, are you sure? Actually, I went naked when I was in there. He didn't want to see that. I'm speaking, yeah, he didn't want to see. Look at him. I like that guy. It's straight. He said naked no. Naked and slut dropping. But, Interesting. But well, you like to see a Nicki Minaj or a lady to do it. That's all right. I like you. That's naked an African slut bubble. dropping. So, so, so you know how? So, so basically, you basically pose naked. Yeah, sometimes I like, you know, I do that depending on the photograph I'm working with. Have you ever been a stripper before? No. I how, so how, I has it ever gotten so bad that no, you needed to strip? No, no. I think the reason, most of the time, the reason I go naked is because. I have some photographers that look at my stature before. You're blessed, like, you know, you're just different, like, you know, my body, this is my body's proportion, which I never knew until... Were these male or female photographers? Female. All of them? <laughs> that one well, there at the there's, Thames? There's only, there's only, no, there's... That I've one there at the Thames, was it male or female? Uh, that, that one is a male. So you got naked in front of a guy? You know, a, yeah, a male and, you know, it's not, it's not a big deal. A male and... Um, okay, yeah. it's not a big deal, it's yeah. fine. Yeah. A male and a female, because well, they Sure, you know, in, in London, it's not a big deal. In Nigeria, 14 years old. Mm. If, you got, if, you, if you get, if you... Okay, I understand. But yeah, you know, one year for each of your picking. <laughs> 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 yeah, but like, you know, I can, I can do that because, you know, it, to me, it's not a big deal mm. to like, you know, go naked. I've been going naked since when. Okay, so you know, like, there's this film that came out, Magic Mike. Well, um, look at those ones. That, you know, <laughs> started... <laughs> You know, stripping. Could you ever do this? Were you? Could you ever be a stripper? May I tell you the truth? Yeah. Okay. Let's get I a close up. Okay, I would. I would strip before a girl. Uh, because you know, it's something that I can ask my girl to do. So too. you could do this, Shay. Like start that, that one. Like a girl doing that to me. I'm not gonna do that. No. <laughs> no, no, that, that, nah, I'm that's not basically let what happens. Grab my, like, look at them. Grab my waist. No, no, no. I think that, that that's going to that's going to too far. Okay. In the first picture, they're there zipping down their trousers. Yeah. And after you zip down your trousers, you know what happens. Yeah, you go. The thong. You wear the thong. Yeah, yeah. You know about that. I like thong anyway. You like thong. Picture, yeah. It's, not a it's for picture. athletes anyway. It's for athletes exactly. Yeah. So could you ever do that? Have you ever practiced maybe your strip moves like? Zip it down. Uh, no, I've never done that. I don't, I don't think I want to do that. I'm too, I don't think I want to do that. But then, okay, now you got that too. <laughs> 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 and the photographer that was working with me over there, she, now that one is a girl. We were in Jersey there. Oh, so you're, you're pull, taking off your trousers for a yeah, girl? Yeah, yeah. Did she, she give you a very good massage? Um, no, no, no. She was not. She was just a photographer. She she follows me around. Okay, okay. Yeah, we were in Jersey then. I think that day, it was, it was my birthday. Oh. I had a lot of girls over there. You can see, like, oh, yeah, it was my birthday. Did you have fourteen girls for each of your picking? No, not fourteen. No, there are more than that, but oh, but no, <laughs> they were not my girls. They just like you know, because you know what? This is what happens to me. I got more girls around me. You know, you're digging yourself deeper in this hole. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but when I say more girls, I'm talking about not not girls like that. I don't touch them. No, you don't. No, I don't. I, you don't need to touch your friends. You know, because if you know, um, <laughs> we're still on the late night show, ladies and gentlemen. Not sort of some sort of porno video, but back to your music, Radical Seven Seven, because <laughs> the girls, the girls out there, your female fans and some of your male ones too, <laughs> want to see your work. You know, they want to see you in action. We got a music video from you, so ladies and gentlemen, let us see Radical Seven Seven in action. So, did you like what you just saw? I know you did. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. If you want to see more, just subscribe to our channel right now.